And damage from the storm is also affecting trolley service around San Diego. Our Jamie Chambers live for us in Old Town with the latest on those disruptions this evening. Jamie. Andrew, it's been very difficult for the MTS. They're working around the clock. We've already seen the crews out there working. Uh, we have seen the blue line and the uh, green line already back up and running on delayed service, but the orange line, that's the one that they're having all the problems with in the Encanto area. The orange line on the MTS has been severely damaged in the aftermath of San Diego's flash floods sweeping through the Encanto area. The mile stretch of trolley track has been undermined by sinkholes, erosion, and support beams have been swept away by the fast moving waters. Out of the orange line out by 65th and Imperial, that's one of our most significantly impacted areas out there. We had a retaining wall that actually came down. The mud and debris still covers the roads near where the waters flooded over the banks of the storm drains, but the Orange Line wasn't the only trolley route affected by the storm. Orange Line was impacted, Blue Line was impacted, Green Line was impacted, our downtown area was flooded out. Uh, but we continue to operate where we could and supplement service with bus service where we could. While the blue line and green line will be coming back in short order, the orange line will be a much heavier lift to reopen a permanent track solution for at least the next few weeks. We have teams that are out there. They're, they're doing some remediation, corrective action work out there. We anticipate we'll get back to both of our tracks operational sometime this afternoon. And hopefully the goal is to have normal service on the blue line delivery delivered again tomorrow for, for our customers. This flash flood event came in quietly and was underestimated by many San Diegans. Now a few weeks of cleanup is on the books for homeowners, businesses, and certainly those who run the MTS. I think that most of the customers realize and recognize that, you know, we had this event, this rain event that really se severely not only impacted MTS's system, but impacted the city of San Diego. And we've just seen the coaster go by, we've seen the surf liner go by, we've seen the blue line and the green line. Those are expected to be close to normal services, but make sure if you are riding any of these mass transits, check in specifically with MTS about what their dynamic system will be tomorrow. There could be a bus uh, section of that orange line for a little while to come, so you want to know exactly how long it's going to take for you to get to where you need to go. That's the very latest from Old Town, Jamie Chambers. Fox 5 News. All right, Jamie, thanks for breaking it down, and we invite everybody to stay with Fox 5 for our continuing coverage of the aftermath of this historic storm. You can get the latest updates sent straight to your phone by downloading the free Fox 5 San Diego mobile app.